these tiny particles provide some big benefits. They're part of a process that reduces air emissions. They're reducing the need for landfills. And they're helping farmers grow better crops. This is FGD gypsum. It's a product from We Energies. FGD gypsum is produced by removing sulfur from coal-fueled power plants. That process is called flue gas desulfurization. We Energies reduces sulfur emissions by more than 95 percent by using advanced wet scrubbing technology. We Energies chose the wet scrubbing process over many other processes. It actually had a more expensive first cost, but we knew that we would get the air quality results that were needed and we would have a usable product, gypsum. The wet scrubbing process attached to our power plants actually produces a more pure form of gypsum than what you would naturally obtain by mining. There's a demand for gypsum. So through ingenuity and investment, We Energies creates a useful product rather than a material that has to be landfilled. We Energies has a long tradition of finding uses for its coal combustion products. Today and in the last several years, we're very proud to say that over 95% of our coal combustion products are finding their way into beneficial uses. Gypsum has many commercial uses. It's used to make the wallboard in our houses. It's used in cement. It increases the time for concrete to set. And it has been used in agriculture for thousands of years. In the past, using gypsum in farming wasn't practical in this part of the country. The product had to be trucked in from other states. And that made it cost prohibitive. That's all changed now that We Energies is a local source for gypsum. We Energy approached the Department of Natural Resources with a request for beneficial use of FGD gypsum in agricultural setting. The department reviewed the application of the V Energy and consulted with the Wisconsin Department of Agriculture and determined that the material is safe for use in the agricultural setting. FGD gypsum was approved in May of 2008. The word got out quite quickly and we started receiving calls from farmers asking if our gypsum could be made available for use in agriculture.